can't be classified, we, we pull the plug. So I hope for their sake this is fixable. No, yeah, I, mean, I think some of, some of you have been asking that exact question. Why do they work so oh. hard and then pull out? It's because that time has been hit. He's yeah. already gone off. That was actually at the Ford chicane because oh. he's come straight into the pit road. Uh, at least he could go that far. Liz, people will uh, keep asking why, when a car comes in that state, why is the first thing they do refuel it? It tends to be a general rule, really. It's basically you, you do all the basics first. You do the refuel and you get the car ready to just come out of the garage and go. Because basically, if you think about it, when you pull the car out to then go back out, if you had to fuel it, you'd have to push it back, you're wasting, fuel it, waste, you'd send be it away, you're wasting time. Yep. time. Yep. The lead two cars from oh. GT1 are both in the oh, garage. Oh, dear, dear. Now, this means that the Saline, that we were talking about this a little bit early on, might have all the luck in the world because uh, the Saline, I'm just trying to see, is a l on the same lap as the second placed car and two behind this vehicle. Wow. It might be that the granddaddy GT1 cars start to pull up. We've got. You know, to the, the Celine's been around for ages. The Corvettes are six years old, I think, that are out there, and maybe they're the ones who are going to keep pulling through. And this car looks like it's been around.